Hey. So, you know how you were always ranting about needing an editor? Like something with insane, high-quality photo tools? You wanted it totally free, no stupid watermarks, remember? Dude, listen to this. I just stumbled across this crazy AI platform that whips up both photos and videos, and seriously, it's got every single thing you were wishing for. I'm talking totally next level. I'm Mila. Today, I'm here to hook you up with an insane new AI. Stop stalling. Let's dive in. So what are we looking at today? It's Veer, the all-in-one AI platform we're about to dive into. As you can see, this site has a ton of tools. Going over every single one isn't really possible, so we're just going to check out a few key ones together. So let's just browse around the site for a minute or two, and then we can get down to testing out the features. Here's what I have in mind. I'm going to test out the text to image generator, the image to video generator, the AI style transfer, and the background changer for you guys. I really hope you agree with this selection. Okay, first things first, let's try out the text to image generator. We'll just select it from the top menu and then click on this button right here that says, generate image from text. This is the easy part. Just type in your prompt right here. But don't forget down at the bottom, we have to pick our model, quality, pro, or the top tier max model. Down here on the side, you can also select the aspect ratio. So let me just quickly set this to 16 to nine right now before I forget. So as I mentioned, you can see that the quality model is completely free and unlimited, which is awesome. But the pro model will use 10 credits and the max model will cost you 20 credits. Also right here, we have two other options, Enhance Prompts and Grammarly. These are super helpful tools that will assist you in writing a better prompt. Okay, so this image you're seeing right now, I gave it a prompt and it created this cute little girl for us using the quality model. Don't worry, I'll definitely put all the prompts I use in the description for you. All right, let's try out the pro model with the exact same prompt we just used. Oh, isn't she just the cutest? Look at the amazing quality, all those sweet little details and the absolutely lovely style it made. It's super magical. So should we give the Max model a try next? Oh wait, I almost forgot. You can actually download the image right from up here too. Okay, this one is excellent too. Let's pull up all three images side by side to compare the results. In my opinion, this platform generates seriously high quality images. As you can see, all three models are genuinely excellent. And even the quality model, which is free and unlimited, is still so good. This truly gives you the freedom to create anything your heart desires. I whipped up some extra cool examples for you guys. Let's throw them on the screen and check them out. Honestly, between these three images, I actually prefer the one from the quality model the most. What I'm trying to say is, even their free model is truly outstanding. Next up on our list is the AI style transfer. Time to get creative. We'll head up to the menu, find the context editor, and click on the AI style transfer feature. Once that window shows up, all we need to do is click Apply Style Now. First, upload your target image here. Then, browse this corner for all the different styles. You have so many creative options, which is awesome. If you have any extra details, type them in here. 
Remember, this feature works with the three models we talked about. Pick your aspect ratio right here, and then we're ready to click Generate. All right, let's do a quick example together. Okay, I've uploaded our little girl's picture and I want to set her style too. Hmm, how about Pixar style? Yeah, that sounds good. Let's go for it. Oh my goodness, she turned out so cute. Okay, so let's go ahead and try another style as well. You can actually see the before and after of your image right here. Okay, now let's try out the Kawaii 3D character style and see how that looks. Whoa, this is also super cute, right? Perfect. I went ahead and generated a bunch more styles off camera. So let's take a quick look at those now. Just so you know, every single one of these pictures was made with the free and unlimited quality model. The quality you get for zero cost is absolutely incredible. Now let's take a look at a few side-by-side -side comparison examples of the quality, pro, and max models. Okay, next up is the background changer. Let's go up to the menu, find image tools, click on the AI background changer tool, and just tap try background changer. It's the same drill here. Upload your photo and pick a style. Notice the background prompt below. It explains the style. Feel free to tweak it, but honestly, sticking with the defaults often gives you the sharpest and best looking result. No need to repeat the steps. I've already run a few examples, so let's quickly jump to comparing the before and after results for the background changes. Okay, time for the grand finale. We're diving into the image to video tool next. Upload your image, same as always. Then, on the right, you've got two interesting prompt areas basic image prompts and camera prompts. You're free to type in your own, use the enhancer for ideas, or simply leave them empty if you prefer. Plus, we have a whole control panel here for customization, video format, length, frame rate, and video dimension. Remember, what you can select in these controls will change slightly based on the quality, pro, or max model you're using. Heads up, for the premium models, be aware of the credit cost. You're looking at 20 credits for every pro generation and a whopping 40 credits for the max model run. This one is simple enough, so instead of going through every single step, let's jump straight to a few case studies so you can see the prompts and the finished videos. Okay guys, I hope you got something out of this video. Thanks for being awesome and catch you in the next one.